Congrats, you found Surviving Together. This is a safe place to discuss openly and honestly sexual assault and related topics and have a lot of topics that I want to cover. Here, you will be heard, understood, and treated with respect and compassion. So again, thank you for visiting. I'll be covering a wide range of topics relating to sexual assault, and this is also for um, sexual assault and Scientology. It is a topic that is near and dear to my heart. My um, grandmother was in a cult and did not receive medical attention in time to save her life. Uh, Scientology is the same. They do not believe in medical attention and they treat their children horribly. So it is also a topic that I will be d discussing as well as just general um, adult and childhood sexual assault. First, I want to define what is sexual assault. What am I going to be talking about? Sexual assault is any non-consensual sexual touching. Now, what's non-consensual? Non-consensual is any time you do not agree. And you cannot agree if you're drunk, if you're high, or if you're a child. Now, for simplicity's sake, I am going under anyone eight, under 18 is considered a child. Now, 17, 18, legally, those are some gray areas. Different states treat them differently. And we'll delve into those at a different point when I cover some legal topics. Who can be affected by sexual assault? Anyone. Literally anyone. It doesn't matter your age, your race, your color, your gender, your sex, your sexual orientation, your religion, your political leanings, whatever, you can be affected. For every single person, there is a predator for whom that is their target demographic. So one of the things that we will be talking about, one of the topics we'll be talking about is how do you protect yourself? How do we decrease the number of sexual assaults that occur each year? And it's through education. Education is the key, as with most anything, right? We teach our children, we teach the adults, and we can have a drastic, drastic impact on the number of sexual assaults that occur each year. And this has been proven um, in regards to studies that they have done. I want to give you two very sobering statistics in regards to sexual assault. Over half of all women and one in three men in their lifetime will suffer some form of sexual assault that involves physical touching. Again, half of all women and a third of all men. That should frighten you. These are astounding statistics and they're something that we should not live with. Because of the subject matter, it is incredibly important that A, you are respectful of each other, B, that this is not a channel that is for people under 18. Confidentiality is critical. You must, must remain quiet about anything that you do here, here. If it's not your story to tell, don't tell it. Because we will be dealing with such potentially triggering subject matters. When we get to our lives, or even with the videos, if you need to stop the video, if you need to step away from the live because it's affecting you too much, please do. Your mental health is paramount. It comes before anything else. If you want to come back to the video later, or if it's something that you just can't come back, please know yourself, be aware of what is happening inside of you, and take care of yourself. <laughs> My video just went blank. <laughs> 
one of the things about this channel too is because we are going to be dealing with such raw subject matter. I don't care about your language. If you want to swear, swear. I don't want you to have to censor yourself when you're dealing with something that is so, so incredibly personal and painful. Um, please try and limit it though. Um, if you're driving, dropping MFers every, you know, other word, we might have to limit that a little bit. Um, I do want everyone to feel included. I don't want to chase anybody off in regards to that. But please understand that if you come here, you may hear some things that you normally wouldn't on some other channels. And that is because of the subject matter, because we're going to be so real with this. If you want to contact me personally by email, you can. It is at Surviving Together, capital S-A-S-S. -S -S, at gmail.com. You can also um, find some resources that I'm going to link in the description below in terms of 24-hour support systems that you can uh, call for numbers to re either reach people in person or to chat online, one-on-one -on -one or in groups. There are some wonderful, wonderful resources that are out there, and I hope that you do get a chance to look at those down below. To find out more about this and to find out more about me and what we're going to be doing here, please watch my welcome video. That's going to be coming next. Um, this is my first time on YouTube, so please be kind. I know that my glasses are um, having a reflection. I don't know what to do about that yet. Um, the camera is not as crisp as I would like it to be. Hopefully the sound is picking up. We'll have to see. So I will see you on the next video. Thank you. Hugs and love. Bye.